Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? Clem? <gasps> Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Looking for something? Sort of. I know this looks bad, but it's not like... It's not like what? I'm just here to talk to Lingard about where AJ is now. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. You've done this before? Yeah, I have. On myself, actually. In much worse conditions. You'll be fine. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. <clears throat> Clem. Are you okay? I'm fine. I started... bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. It means you're... growing up. Blossoming into your, you know, like, womanhood. Your body is, is developing, and then things change, but it, it'll be okay. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. <sighs> Wake up! Talk to me! Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Can you hear me? Does he look like he can hear you? <sighs> Wake up! Talk to me! <clears throat> wow, that guy is really out of it. Not what I'm looking for. Cody? Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. No thanks. and ready to go. Here we go. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. you handle it. Kate will take care of you. Think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay. Hold still. Try not to breathe. 
Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. You weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you want it. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Even Ava would have to admit, I was a good mom to AJ. Whoa there, Clem. It's just me. What the hell do you want? I'm really glad I found you. Clementine, I know this is hard. I'm so sorry about what happened with AJ. Really, I, I am. What happened wasn't easy for any of us. You have to give AJ back, please. He needs me. I need him. That's just not gonna happen, Clem. Look, it's not much, but here. David wanted you to have that. AJ drew it just after you... It calmed him down. <gasps> this... Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Consider it a peace offering? We care about you. Just try to remember that even if it feels wrong, people can still be trying to do the right thing by you. Listen, it's dangerous out here, and right now... You're... hurting. Whatever you do, you can't let what happened get to you. You need to keep a level head. Plan for after that. You're strong, but that won't get you far if you don't know what you're doing. Or where you're headed. I can make it on my own, just like I always have. I don't need anybody else. I don't blame you. Just don't overestimate what you're actually capable of. For me... Staying alive has always been about finding people I could trust as much as they trusted me. That's what the new frontier has been. A silver lining. Made me feel worth a damn. Kept me going in the worst of times. You'll find yours. I know you will. Someone, or something, they're out there. You people stole mine! You know that! You'll just have to find something new that- Shut the hell up! Oh, grow the hell up, kid. You think this was easy for any of us? You're not the only one suffering. We all are. You're just not adult enough to make the tough decisions. You're gonna have to accept this world for what it is sooner or later. Or else you won't survive it. Trust me. I don't need your fucking pity. Or your shitty supplies. I came here thinking we could find some common ground. I don't want to be wrong. Let's at least not leave things on a bad note this time. What do you say? Please, Clem. Thank you. Just leave me alone now. Please. Good luck out there, kid.
That's what keeps me going. There's things I have to stay alive to do. <sighs> so, what do you think? I think I'm getting better. Nice work. Thanks. Just glad I could help. You coming? I still have to ask Lingard about AJ. <sighs> Hello, Clementine. Javier. Thought you were rotting in a cell with David. There any chance he got out too? I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. Despite all her pleasantries, She's a cruel bitch. Joan took him before I got out. I haven't seen him since. That poor bastard. He's... He's not getting out. Guess there's only one sure way to get away from Joan these days. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. If you think that, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered, David was the one who stepped up. Took personal responsibility for that kid. You say that like it's a good thing. I really doubt he was a positive influence. David's the reason the kid's better off now than, than he's ever been. You can be as mad as you want about how, about how things panned out. The fact of the matter is, David's been good for AJ, among others. Clem is AJ's family. No kid is better off when you break their family apart. Maybe you're right. Maybe AJ should be with Clem. All I know is that he's better than he was when he got here. No thanks to you or David. I stand by what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then. You... You want to know where the boy is? What do you want? I just want to die. I want you to inject this into me. Hang in there. Tomorrow's another day. I, I can't. When your brother found me, he... He got me to care about everything I'd given up on. My life. Other people. Even this goddamn place. Without him around. I don't want to care anymore. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. to know. I've been looking for too long. I can't lose him now. Not when I'm this close. I'll do it. Well, where is he? He's... He's at the McCarroll Ranch. A few miles west of here. He's really alive. Don't forget to stick around to handle the after part. I don't want to become one of those monsters. Don't forget, Joan's looking for you and your friends. You better hope she does. Huh. 
Finally. Oh, hey. Uh, hi, Clementine. What the fuck are you doing here? She's with me. You all good? Yeah. We're all set. Let's roll. Mm, good to see you. 